name is Neil Prefer. I'm an ear, nose, and throat specialist here in Williamsburg for ENT and Allergy Associates, and I'm going to talk to you today about things you can do at home to help relieve sinus pain. So, in order to understand sinus pain, we first have to understand what the sinuses are. And these are basically air-filled cavities that are in our face, over here, over here, in between our eyes, and in the back. And it has a very thin lining of our mucous membranes. And each sinus drains through a very small opening, and as long as that opening is working, you should have, in general, no pain. The problem starts when that opening gets blocked, and the two most common causes of blocking are either allergies or infections. So, the um, things that you can do at home, the simplest thing to try to um, clean out the nose are saline. You can buy saline nasal spray over the counter or even the steam in the shower or if you get a pot of boiling water and hold your head over that, that steam will help clear up some of the mucus and get that opening um, working again. If um, you want to relieve only the pain, Tylenol is an effective pain reliever but even more effective for this type of thing if you're able to take it is Advil which is a pain reliever and an anti-inflammatory. Oral decongestants like Sudafed or that class of medication can also help to shrink down the mucous membranes and hopefully open up the uh, sinus passageways. Um, the more effective treatments for this, if it's affecting you a lot, are an oral, a uh, nasal decongestant spray like Afrin, but it's very important not to use that for more than four days in a row, otherwise it can cause an addiction. And um, a very common medication that's used for this are antihistamines. If you have allergy symptoms and you're quite sure this is caused by allergies, you can use an antihistamine, but for sinus infection, an antihistamine doesn't help too much. The most important thing to know is this, if this is going on for more than seven days, it's more likely to be a bacterial infection, and you can consider coming into one of our offices. You can book online anytime, and if you call us today, you can see us today.